And we're back! Welcome back, everyone, to... The, the Balcony! balcony. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> this is the Juicy J, and joining me, as always, is... Uh, Captain Poopmonger. Yes. The USS Poopsatron. A.K.A. Einhander. So what were we doing last time? We had to find a... No, we got a candle. Yes, we got a candle, and we're going to go use it on that weird device. Oh, as soon as yes. I punch this elephant. Fuck that elephant. Now, man, that's against the law. Is it? I don't think the elephant would mind. I don't know why it should be against the law. Suitcase tag. If you are ambitious cute. enough to carry out a fucking of an elephant, A, the elephant doesn't mind, and B... Kudos, I guess. Horrifyingly dangerous, I'd imagine. You'd have to have, like, a ladder? Stilts! <laughs> I want you to picture somebody fucking an elephant on a pair of stilts. I thought I... We will not get it on. I, I thought I got a candle. I, uh, go talk to that sunshiny person. Soleil. Soleil DeVito. And the Danny DeVito, baby. That is not how that goes. And I got a DeVito, baby. Oh, hey, I'm going to smack that ass. Oh, boy, I can't wait to see what's in this. Hooray! Oh, shit. <laughs> Did it, Mao? Oh, uh, it's an orphanage. Back for rice. Oh, uh, boy. <laughs> whoosh, whoosh. Dance for rice. Sing. Watch ballet. You put on your tutu. Fuck. <laughs> Damn. That's... You got a lot of brains, bro. I need... When did you get all that health upgrade? Can't get a good grip. Got it. I don't yeah. know. And I got a Davida, baby. Don't Who's that by? Some guy. Uh, uh. Oh god, I've broken him. Uh. He's smoking. There's smoke coming yeah. from his ears. Uh. Hang on, rebooting Juicy J. <laughs> I legitimately don't remember. <laughs> and that's really upsetting. Yeah, because that seems like a thing you would know. It is. For those of you that don't know the story, that song is supposed to be called In the Garden of Eden. In fact, I think it is. But he showed up, whoever it was, he showed up to the, uh, the recording studio so fucked up that when he tried to sing In the Garden of Eden, baby, it came out, In a Garden of Eden, baby. And they kept it. So now they just call the song In Agata De Vida. Or that's how it's colloquially known. Yeah, and it's like 20 minutes long, so you play that back to back with Freebird, and it's a good way to go out, smoke a joint, and uh, take a shit if you're a DJ. Or like a whale oil renderer. And other professions that don't exist anymore. There are still DJs. We saw one at the bar across the street a couple of uh, months ago. Okay. Remember DJ 40-something? Spinning his dopest remixes of 80s rock tracks. Yeah, I meant like radio disc jockeys. Oh, like a real DJ. <laughs> yeah. Sorry anyone that fancies themselves a DJ in 2015. You're not a real thing anymore. No, I have Spotify. You are replaced. Wah, wah. Sorry. That is a legitimate form of art. I like the Tom Petty song, The Last DJ, as much as anybody. Sorry for the pause there. I was, uh, I had to drink my this. Drink your this. Uh, let's see, what what are we drinking this evening? I, you got a, got a tall boy Tecate? Tall boy nothing, that's 24 ounce. Oh. It's a big one, that's a double. Yeah, I know. It's a double. Um, yeah, it's a double Tecate for double the, uh, whatever Mexico's version of white trash is. Man, you, uh, 
<laughs> oh god! What? The That's not what I thought that did at all. It's spotlight. I thought it was a little helicopter. Bonita Soleil is about to take the stage. Flower girls in position one. Her eyes don't point the same direction. What the fuck is that? Gloria Von Guten, the famous actress. In this nostalgic memory of her breakthrough role, they don't have enough room for brains. Sunshine Shenanigans. Their heads are flat. Sunshine Shenanigans. Oh shit. Is it Lobato? Gloria B. Without her views, her inner sunshine, the spirit of her youth. Play tonight. Pokemon. Hooray. Hello. Oh, I do so <laughs> hope that my mother is proud of me. Your mother will never love you. Oh, ah. Bix. Phantom. Yeah, I've seen some bad plays in my day, <laughs> but this one's an actual menace. And it's all her fault. It's her bad acting that makes the Phantom strike. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to file a formal complaint and get this theater shut down. Great. Well, I'm off to go kill myself. You know, you could be a more constructive <laughs> critic. Kid, if you wow. want to see a good play, come talk to me. I've got a script here that'll knock him dead, I promise. Hmm. Hey! Whoa, 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 whoa! Careful! That's the manual mood override. That's how we set the right mood for the play. Mess of course. With that. We'll have happy plays on sad sets, sad plays on happy sets, total chaos, or worse, improv. Oh, so God. No. Oh, the humanity. The manual mood override, unless you want to see some strange stuff happen. Yeah, we wouldn't want that at all. Hit the switch. I should go give her a piece of my mind. Give her a piece of my D. Gimme. Kind of fucked up shit we gonna get out of this. Oh god. Yeah! Some Jack Skellington shit. Yeah! Oh no! Welcome to Agatha Home School for Girls, where you will begin your long and painful training in the theatrical discipline. And get your ass in the box! Well, I'm sorry, she's in Atlantic City on her knees earning a living. Your mom has a career and the police don't think about She doesn't have time for an ugly little girl like you. Crotch droppings, all of you. Now get back in the box. There is nothing more tedious than our tears of an unlovable child. Nothing more delicious either. Ha cha 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 cha. Our unsupervised janitor, Mr. Johansson, sure would like to meet you. <laughs> you can write all complaints to uh, go fuck yourself at P.O. Box <laughs> dot uh, P.O. Box dot gov Yeah, P.O. Box, we don't give a shit dot gov Find a way up to the catwalks Maybe we should go check out that dude's uh, Oh god Oh, whoa <laughs> Maybe we should go check out the balcony guy's script yeah, let's go do that. He seems like a guy with good ideas. I like the cut of his jib. Yeah, well. Also, watch out for the buzzsaw crabgrass. Hey, can Here we you go. help me get up to the catwalk so I can fight that phantom? Ah! Can't get there from here! <laughs> I mean, unless you did that one particular play on that one. Particular set. Oh, but what did I say? That's almost impossible. Of course. Forget about it. The theater is doomed. That is impossible. Uh, yeah, grill that dude. Give him the third degree. If you hate the show so much, why don't we just leave? Oh, we gotta have something to do. Looking at it, it's like the sight of a horrible car accident. <laughs> a car Sounds like something we'd say. <laughs> And the paramedics forget their lives. That's what I said. <laughs> hey, why 
have to be so hard on Benita? I'm trying to save you from that mysterious phantom. Because I want to you fuck her and she won't give me the time of day. If we got rid of <laughs> little Miss Sunshine, we'd all be safer now, wouldn't we? I'm only thinking of the children. I bet yeah. you think about children all the time. Ah, cha 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 cha. Benita's just trying to lighten things up around here. Ah! I've seen Don't be a dick. shines on a shoe. <laughs> I like she that. Quit now, while she can still get a job as a nice light. <laughs> <laughs> If you can't say something nice, don't say anything at all. The young boy's protests, though heartfelt, quickly lapsed into simplistic and tedious platitudes. One and a half stars. Damn! He left you a scathing review in the editorial section. Incineration! You were the insult master. This play has some action in it. Some Oh, he gave me the play. Thanks. Cool. Are you actually being nice? No, I'm just trying to keep myself halfway entertained. Now get out of here before I'm sick. Becky and see if she can't find some actors to ruin it. <laughs> I like the cut of his jib. Let's see. Night of Joy. Gee, I wonder if his play is the right play. I hope it's a comedy. I love comedies. Um, I hope it's a rom-com. I'm not much of a tragedy guy. I'm a psychonaut. Just show me how to get up to those catwalks he hides out in. Sorry, no way up there. Well. Then how did you fuckers hang the lights? Bring me to your stage text. Her left eye looks. Look at her fucking eye. <laughs> yeah, I was trying not to. We're so desperate for new material around here. It's because you're trapped in a crazy woman's brain. New script? Night of joy. Morals tomorrow, a comedy tonight. It's like popcorn and it doesn't say which set to play it on. Oh well, we'll just play it on whatever's on stage. I mean, what could possibly go wrong? Oh good. Right? Here, you can be my first AD. Use the megaphone if you want to run the play again. Oh, uh, I get to cycle scripts, through everybody. sets and lights until I get the right one. And yeah. Action. Let's see, Night of Joy. So it's probably a happy thing, and we probably want some sort of castle in the background. He was brave in thought and deed. Can't you hear his mighty steed? Yeah, just ride on by, Sir Deadbeat's dad. Don't hang around to help raise your poor daughter, sir. Do I? S am I getting a whiff of daddy issues with the uh, sultry old man? Well, I mean, hell, that's a common theme in life. Horrifying. You know, I mean, hell, that's where Freud's theories came from. I think everybody's what little... plowing his mom. Yeah. What is this? Uh... Doing a great job there, Becky. <laughs> Nobody's ever said that before. Hey, Becky, let me get them digits. Yeah, we'll get them digits next time here at the balcony at the next show. To the lobby! Out you go. Right on. Everybody get out. Yes. Bye. Bye. We gotta reset the stage. <laughs>